Hey, Tom Buell here with a Make Today Great Moment, and this is one that I promised uh, is life-changing. This particular statement that I'm going to share with you is a statement that someone shared with me back in 1992 that made me reevaluate everything in my life and notice that I had been living a life by default and that he was exactly right in that statement. So we'll get to that shortly, but the brief backstory is this. I had uh, dropped out of college, I had moved to New York City where, with nowhere to live, but fortunately through an a, a amazing uh, coincidence of running into my ex-stepfather in the middle of the street at 3 in the morning, um, I stayed with him for three months. Then I went back up to New, upstate New York, Rochester area, and lived with my father, my dad, and didn't have a job. My dad's like, hey, I got a friend at this factory, I'll see if he has any openings. So I end up working at this factory. And I excel in everything that I do because I put my stamp of approval on everything I do. I, I make sure if I'm doing this, I'm going to do the best that I possibly can. So I was doing very well in this factory job that was uh, 3 to 11 was my shift. 3 p.m. in the afternoon to 11 p.m. And many times I worked the shift after that, the 11 to 7 shift. So my life uh, was not going um, in a direction that I had anticipated. And this, mind you, is after uh, I had already been a national bicycle champion and was signed autographs for hours at a time when we're putting on events and things like that. So here I am in a, a factory with earplugs, um, far from signing autographs, but actually signing boxes of pr products that I'm producing for this factory. And I'm doing well. I'm rising through the ranks. I'm a hard worker, very quality uh, product I'm creating. And there's uh, a path for me to get uh, promoted to uh, a different level. So the person who's already at the different level saw this, and here's what he said to me. He pulled me aside. He's like, hey, look, I know uh, based upon you know conversations at the lunch breaks we had that you're looking to get your own apartment and get a new car, which is going to add uh, expenses to you. He's like, you're exactly where I was 20 years ago, and what I'm going to tell you um, could change your life. Uh, he said, uh, you don't belong here. You're better than this. Um, he's like, look, do you want to wake up 20 years from now and be here at the same spot where I am? Because I was where you are 20 years ago, and I got an apartment. I got a new car. I got a girlfriend. Next thing you know, I had these monthly bills, and I was trapped, and here I am 20 years later. Do you want to be here 20 years from now? And what that question did to me and what that statement did to me was make me open my eyes and say, no, my goodness, no, I, I don't want to be here 20 years from now. I had been living a life by default kind of, you know, just by accident, not by design. And although I was on a path that uh, would be great for many, I knew I had bigger and better things that I wanted to accomplish. So my statement to you uh, is, you don't belong here. You deserve better. You can contribute more. What do I mean? I'm talking about your, your health, your relationships, and your finances. Are you settling? Are you really putting your foot forward? Are you really designing the life that you know you're capable of living? I know for a fact, just by you choosing to watch this video, you can do some deep reflection and say there's areas that you can improve. You're not giving it your all. I'm going to challenge you to look at your life. You don't belong here. There's more for you to accomplish. Um, start looking at the, those three areas, your health, your relationships, your finances. Recognize which, which of those is the most pressing concern that you know, you're right, Tom, I don't belong here. I, I can do better than this. It's time for me to step my game up. It's time for me to dream bigger. It's time for me to plan where I want to be and take massive action steps to get there. So that's my challenge to you. You don't belong here. You're better than this. Share with me what you come up with on that introspection this weekend. I hope you're having an awesome day. I look forward to chatting with you soon. Until then, make today great.